We're going to show you the AmmoBot Primer Pocket Probe, which is available for either small or large. These are replaceable pins, so you can order each. When you buy it, you buy one or the other, and then you can buy the other pin if you need the large or small primer pin. Very simple installation, and you're going to need a 530 seconds Allen wrench to complete it. All right, to start, put your arm down so you can actually get to the bracket you need. Take that uh, 530 seconds wrench, loosen the screws that hold the, the bracket on. Move the bracket, set it aside. Next step, and I use the 530 seconds wrench or anything else for this that will grab it. You have to remove this cotter pin. Just be able to pull it out of there. Set it aside, don't lose it. Then remove this pin. Use the, the wrench to push the pin out. Reach over. Pull the pin, set it aside. Now to start removing the, the original swage rod. So it came out real easy there, but if it's, if it's hard to get, you might have to un twist your your swage rod and bring it up higher so that you can remove that bracket and fold it out of the way so you've got the room to move your swage rod Now we're going to install the primer probe. So move the wire to the front because it needs to come out the front because of the switch. Slide the shaft up. It is on a spring. So you can manipulate it a little bit. Maneuver it in. There we go. Slip it in. Move the bracket into position. Place the pin. And place a cotter pin. Now it's installed. Now to adjust it, you adjust it the same way you adjust the swage rod. And for this, you need a 1 16th wrench for the set screw here to move the shaft to the right, to the appropriate position to get it to, into the right position. Now what it will do is when it comes into a piece of ringered brass, like this one, the probe will enter it and not be able to go completely forward. It will open the switch and stop the machine. All right, to demonstrate, again, here's the ringered brass. It's in position. As we draw it down, that probe can't enter that pocket. You see the plate, and now the switch is open, and the machine will stop. Reinstall the bracket that you removed. Just put the screws back in, and tighten them up with the with the uh, 5 30 seconds wrench. So the last part of the primer probe is plugging it in. So find a way to route it so it doesn't interfere and get caught in any of the chains or gears. Route it around your machine, bring it to the back, and plug it in to the blue port. Blue to blue, they're animals.